In this video, we're gonna be talking about some of the softing equipment. So this is the Link Expert M3, and then here is the Cable Master FO for testing fiber. So we're gonna be using these two devices to test some fiber. And then also, we're gonna be looking at the Wire Expert for certifying category cable. And I actually have Tom Jallo in studio with us from softing, so this is awesome. All right, y'all check it out. Okay, this is the Softing's Link Expert M3. This tool has the ability to test copper, fiber, and Wi-Fi. And at under $2,000, it is a lot of bang for your buck. It's a tool designed entirely by Softing, and uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. Let me show you some of the stuff this tool can do. Let's jump into the fiber testing menu. I'm gonna hit the tools button. You can see I've got choices here between copper, fiber optic testing, and Wi-Fi testing. Let's just choose the fiber optic menu. You can see I've got a few options here. I've got an option for a built-in VFL or visual fault locator or red laser. I can turn that on and you can see that. There we go. So we've got a built-in red laser for troubleshooting fiber. Let's just do that real quick. Let's grab a fiber to test. plug in an adapter here and let's take a peek at that fiber. Red laser should go through this and tell us where the open is and sure enough we've got a broken fiber optic link here. You can see the actually the light bleeding out of the jacket. Right? So just really quick troubleshooting with the Link Expert M3 and the VFL. We've also got abilities to ping over fiber, pull IP address over fiber, a lot of other options in here. Let's take a look at this function here, the TXRX function with the Link Expert M3. I'm going to click on it. I can grab an SFP. So here's an SFP. I'm going to drop that into the tester. And immediately I get the metadata off the SFP. If that SFP is dead, that's not going to pop up. I can see the power out and the power in on this SFP. So I can grab a fiber. Let's just grab a fiber link here. And I can connect on one side of the fiber and take a peek at the other side. And I've got a 50-50 shot here to see. There it is. So I can see power in and power out. I'm just making a loop with this fiber optic circuit here. Let's get that out of the way. So I can see the difference. I'm losing 0.12 dBMs on this fiber optic. I can test a mile or two of fiber here, no problem. And I get instantaneous feedback. You see how quick that is. It drops off. As soon as I plug it back in, I get quick value my link light pops up i can also use this basically as my fiber optic light source so let's do that real quick and i'll use that with the cable master fo this is another tool from softing softing it's inexpensive it works with seven different wavelengths it has a built-in flashlight it also has a built-in red laser or visual fault locator on there again seven different wavelengths it saves test results up to 50 results to this device it's rechargeable let's go use this as my power source the link expert m3 and i can see exactly what i'm putting out here so my power out from the link expert m3 in 850 is 2.5 dbms and i can take a very quick measurement watch how quick this is into the link expert or sorry the cable master fo as soon as i plug that in I've got 2.45, 2.45 coming in, 2.42 coming out. So instantaneous reading on fiber optic circuits, right? So it's not a certification test. It's not an OTDR test. But if I want to find out as fast as possible whether or not a fiber optic circuit is healthy and how much loss I have on it, this combination right here, it doesn't get any faster than that. 